All right, guys, so we here with Juan Cruz. Juan Cruz is a contemporary artist, Latino, Hispanic. Um, tell us where you're from, Juan. Um, I am from Dallas, Texas. Dallas, Texas. And I was born here in Dallas. I am 30 years old. What's your ethnicity? Um, I'm Latino. I will consider myself Latino or Mexican American. Um, my dad and mom are Mexican, but I was born in Dallas, so first generation. First generation. So, um, tell us more about what inspires you as an artist. What drives you? What inspires me and drives me. I think it would have to be knowing that I'm able to change someone's life by by helping them um, grow. Um, you know, and artistically or just you know. Um, showing that they can do it as well. I think that drives me a lot. Um, also, just life. You know? so. Well, what got everything started? How do you became an artist? <laughs> what made you think that that's what you love? Uh, I think I was in elementary. No, I was in elementary school. And on uh, third grade, um, there was a kid in my class that... Um, he was drawing, tracing, or I don't know what he was doing, but it kind of got me motivated to kind of do it. I don't know, something about drawing, it just it clicked with me. So I was thinking more about like, you know, Lion King, I was thinking of Little Mermaid and stuff like that, you know, when movies were coming out, early 90s. Um, so yeah, that kind of got it started, but you know, my mom throughout the years, she. She's been doing a lot of like crafts and you know just art, so it, it really I think that helped me grow, you know, artistically. And uh, what are some of your achievements? Some achievements. Um, well, I had the pleasure to you know study abroad in uh, in Italy. That's one. I never thought I would go to Italy. Um, you know, that's one. Um, I'm kind of represented by Mary Thomas Gallery, Mari Tomas Gallery. Um, had the opportunity to work with Fred Villanueva, who's also Latino, uh, here in the city of Dallas. Um, I've gotten selected for several projects in Dallas, working with kids um, through the uh, CAP program, which is a culture artist program. Also, um, I've shown in several different areas in Dallas um, in, in Florence as well in Italy um, so yeah I think those are some of my you know, greatest achievements and I graduated from uh, UNT University of North Texas which you know it's it's a great deal for me because I think that was one of my main goals um, as an artist of color just because you know it's, it's, it's crazy out there you know? but that paper means a lot so yeah great great so tell us uh, a little more about your work uh, what is that you present to us in your uh, pieces um, in my work um, basically I try to depict like uh, cultural issues or social issues around the city and just around myself. Um, also focusing on my culture background um, through color or, or just symbols. My work is um, representational meets abstraction, uh, very influenced by the 1960s, as well as uh, Mexican muralists, um, such as Diego Rivera, Siqueiros, but more than anything it's just Philip Guston in 1960s, um, Franz Klein, and here are some of my works that I'm currently working on. You can see the process of how they kind of start. It's very, very expressive, but I think it's, uh, it's just my natural state. <laughs> As a Latino, I don't know, it's just like this native in me, you know? Um, but yeah, um, that's kind of what I want to present to you like be able to communicate a message through my narrative paintings drawings and 
yeah, through color as well. You know, color means a lot. Um, maybe you might be confused of why like color is such or why a thing is a certain color, but I mean, I guess if you just gotta look at it. <clears throat> but yeah. All right, nice. Well, we're coming to an end. Uh, the last question. Uh, I want to know what are your goals for the near future? My goals? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm currently working at uh, Booker T. Washington High School. Um, I'm a technician for fabrication, which is new media, new technology. Uh, my goal is to go to grad school, which is next year, 2020, in New York. Um, not in Dallas. I'm sorry, guys. But it's just New York. It's, I'm painting a bigger um, and also be able to teach like in about two years, three years be at a level where I'm like you know, teaching other students what I've learned, what I've gone through I think that's one of my main goals it's like to get that master's degree um, full ride of course but whatever, you know, whatever happens, happens all right, well, thank you, Juan. Thank you for your time. Thank you for this interview. Um, where can we find your work? You can find my work at uh, Mary Mari Tomas Gallery on Dragon Street. Um, just look up Mari Tomas Gallery. I currently have a show till September 27th, I believe. I can't remember. I'm sorry. It's just, um, you could also go to uh, my Instagram, um, which is J underscore Cruz underscore Art. 19 and you'll find me there as well so but yeah if you have any questions i could ask here my friend good friend chewy <laughs> and uh yeah all right man well thank you again thank uh you. we wish you the best of luck in your career and we stay tuned all right thank you. yeah thank, thank you man